That's a lot of Mario's. Yeah. Oh shit, do you remember in the fucking, uh... In Clone High, when- oh shit, I think some shit's happening. <laughs> It was like the, the episode of Ponce died, and he's like, Now Mario's dead! I'm killing everyone! Oh, why couldn't Ponce have three lives like Mario? <laughs> <laughs> oh, great, Excel, Gordis, we brought the Princess Peach you ordered, sir! I forgot the voice of the Princess Peach. Do you want to be Gordis? Sure. Alright. Well, 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 my pet. Isn't it about time you told us where the map is? Princess Peach, you will speak when spoken to. I'm telling you, I don't know! I think that's the voice I gave her. <laughs> There's no point in trying to hide it, silly girl. We know you had it. We know this. Where are the nudes? <laughs> Where's the crack? <laughs> Trust me, it's very much in your interest to be absolutely honest with us. We x knots are not all rainbows and lollipops. I assure you, we're quite nasty. Like we a like, trizzler? We like feet. <laughs> Gross! You guys gotta find better fetishes! <laughs> don't do it, don't! Gota, sir, I have news. Report at once. You know that crystal star we thought maybe Hooktail had? Well, someone nabbed it. What? What did you say? Someone else is after the crystal stars? That's, that's what I said, sir. And he defeated that hotel creature, you say? Speak, soldier! Well, you're not letting me fucking talk. <laughs> yes, sir. Uh, sorry, sir. There's more, too. See, according to the report, it was a mustache dude in a red hat and blue overalls who pulled the job. Mario! Excuse me? Mario? Oh, no! Oh, she made the little oh no in my ear! It was so cute! <laughs> <laughs> I see, so you know this Mario, do you? What? No, that's crazy! <laughs> you said you sent him your nudes? That should have been me! No! <laughs> this fool matters not at all. I'll know all about him before long, that I promise. I grow bored of talking. Take Princess Peach back to the holding room. Yes, sir. And men, take good care of Princess Peach, understand? She is not to be harmed. You got it, sir. Eggs not. <laughs> well, Lord Crump, if this Mario character has the map, then it's highly likely he'll find the crystal star we're hunting in the Ugly Woods! Ugly Woods, okay. You must return there immediately and hasten the ex excavation. It must not fail. What's up? Yeah, 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 sure. Roger Grotus, and with that, pal, I'm gone! <laughs> I wonder if sending Lord Crump there alone is wise. He's a bit stupid. <laughs> hmm. X not, I summon you. This suit's stuffy. <laughs> you rang, dude? I mean, sir? You rang, sir? Grotus, dude? Grotus, sir? Grotus, sir? <laughs> Shut up! Go get the Shadow Sirens over here. The uh, Shadow sh Sirens, sir? But they. I don't care how you plan to end that sentence, stupid. Go get them now. Gotcha. It's not. Why is everyone around me so fucking stupid? <laughs> the Honorable Grotus. Oh wait, this is the Shadow, the Shadow one. The Honorable Grotus has needed of us. Then we arrive without delay. All right. So you voice that one. <laughs> Pray tell, did the princess tell you where the map is? Still your tongue, Beldum. We should already have it if you'd snatched her earlier. But now, since you missed your chance, some poor fool named Mario has the map. It wasn't my fault, truly! There were too many prying eyes there, too many! Besides, a strange old man showed up at the moment of truth and we had to retreat. Why worry? All we need is now is to find this Mario and steal the man. Yes. Indeed, that is your duty. Must I remind you that map is vital to the X not play. I will have my men prepare all available information on this Mario. For now, hear me, Beldum. You Shadow Sirens must take care of this troublemaker. <laughs> Fear not, sire. I, Beldum, shall. <laughs> Beldum changed voice real quick. <laughs> my bad. My bad. My bad. Uh, s s sorry, I was I was imitating you. <laughs> Fear not, sire. I, Beldum, shall return with what you seek. 
Let's go, my lovelies. Marilyn, Vivian, come. We've got a job to do. Go! Why was that idiot mocking me with, with my own voice? Yeah. Oh dear, here we go again! I can't believe I'm kidnapped again! Mario and Toadsworth must be wearing sick! Again! Man, this happens a lot! I mean, like, life alert! <laughs> Oh, hang on a moment. Where in the world am I anyway? It's so unfamiliar. I wish I could at least tell Mario and Toadsworth that I've been caught. And, like, they couldn't fucking realize that sooner. Oh, shit. I don't think I can save yet. Well. Princess Peach! <laughs> it's fine. Oh, oh, shit. Wait, can we take a shit? <laughs> Can we can we get our nudes? Yeah. Oh, this mirror doesn't work. I like how the toilet paper is pink too. Just to remind us that she's a girl. Can I? Oh. What a lovely shower! No soap scrub even. I wonder if it works. Nudes. Oh, she's singing. Wait, did you ever think you'd get a Princess Peach bathing scene in a Paper Mario game? No. Dang, she dried off fast. Yeah. And she got that dress on pretty quickly, too. Oh, look at her! How refreshing! I feel like a new princess! Look how cute it is! Now it's time to go take a shit! Yeah. The three, no, no. the three of us is shit, shower, and shave. <laughs> now that I'm all clean, I'm gonna take a massive shit. <laughs> and then take another shower after. Yeah. And then shave my chin. <laughs> oh, her hair's back down. <gasps> oh. Mm, what's that? Hey, how odd. The doors open by themselves. It's like faulty. Like... Like, you know those shitty ones at the grocery store that open automatically when, when it sensors and whatnot? Yeah. It's like a shitty one of that. Weird! It doesn't look like anyone's around! Gorbis ran out of funding. Yeah, Gor- yeah. Yeah, we could hire those three x nuts. Yeah. It doesn't work! Okay. Is there anything else on this floor? Oh. How can I keep making these doors open? How odd! It, are they not automatic doors or something? <laughs> oh my god, technology! <laughs> Holy shit! Hello, Princess Peach. Huh? What? Who said that? Where are you? How amusing. I am right here before your eyes. I am this laboratory's main computer. I am the Tech XX. Many call me Tech. You may. Sir Grotus created me to be a perfect computer, one that is flawless in its reason. Yo, it's ChatGPT! Yo, it is ChatGPT. They called it like, when was this out? 2004? <laughs> Grotus, wait! Is he that awful dumbhead thing who interrogated me, right? He's an asshole! <laughs> Sir Grotus is not awful. He's a very great person. He is marvelous. Maybe to you! <laughs> he also coded me to say this. Yeah. It's right here in my script. <laughs> <laughs> well, I don't think so. But I doubt I'll change your mind. So I'm wondering, why did you leave me in here? I am unsure. An unusual program deviation occurred when I observed you earlier. <laughs> did he observe her in the shower? Yes. Oh. <laughs> My higher brain circuitry malfunctioned and nearly overheated at your image. He did look at her in the shower! Your nudes. They made me calm. <laughs> also, an unidentified impulse sped through my processors. These events are new to me. I just got a computer boner. <laughs> There's more of this phenomenon as well. I ran diagnostic programs. And their solution was... I want to know more about you. I want to observe you. Dude is crushing hard. Such a compulsion has no precedence. Cause unknown. I, the perfect computer. 
I must diagnose this usual situation. I will not fail. That is why I led you here. Wesley. <laughs> Wait, did you just say you want to observe me? To know me more? <gasps> Fucking stalker! Could it be that you... No, impossible, it can't be! You're a computer! And I'm but a mere prince! It's like forbidden love or some shit like that. What has happened to me? If you know my malfunction, you must tell me of it. Oh, I couldn't really because it's just so weird. Please tell me, please. I am the world's best computer. I am perfect. There should not be anything that I do not understand, please. Well, you know, maybe. Is it possible that while you're in love? Me? Love? What is love? I cannot compute this. Can't you just run a fucking Google search? <laughs> Wait, you don't know what love is? Not even like the basic definition of love? This guy's an idiot. <laughs> love, how do I explain this? Love tells you what you want to be with someone forever. It means you feel happy just to see that person happy. Smiling, having fun. When you love someone, you will do anything to help when he or, her, he or she is in trouble. Happiness, fun. I have definitions for these words, but... But you don't have a fucking definition for fun. My programming is insufficient. It sounds like it. There should be nothing I cannot comprehend. I am a perfect computer. Comprehend love? Love is not something you comprehend, Zach. You feel it. Da -da -da -da. Princess Peach, will you teach me to feel this thing you call love? Will you stroke my handles? <laughs> Please touch my buttons in a particular order. <laughs> you see this lever right here? Feels like my cock. <laughs> Why? You're a computer! Why do you care about love? I am perfect. There must be nothing that I cannot comprehend. Nothing. That is why you must help me understand this thing called love. Please. That is me. If you have any wishes that I can grant you in exchange, I will grant them. Hey, can you get me out of here? But I, of course, am unable to grant you such a wish as letting you escape. Fuck! What, are you insane? You extras kidnapped me like common Koopas! And now you're calling me in here to ask you to, to teach you about the meaning of love? You just- I should spit on your screen! You grant my wishes? Huh? Why should I believe you? I understand you are angry. That emotion I comprehend. You need not teach me now. But I must learn of this thing. I must. There is no alternative. I must be a perfect computer. That is why, if you would just consider teaching me, I will grant your wishes. Do you understand me, Princess Peach? Now tell me your wish. Are you sure? <coughs> she puts a little fun in my mouth. Well, okay, here goes. Can I contact someone? The sooner the better. Yes, of course you may. Use my communicator to send a wireless mail to anywhere you want. If you so wish, you can use it right now. It is no trouble. Use the keyboard in front of you. Enter the recipient, address, and message. I thought it would keep going. You mean this keyboard? The one that looks like a keyboard? This is me. You've never seen a fucking computer before? Alright, let me give this a shot. <laughs> What's the fucking letter thing? Dear pesky plumbers, the <laughs> Cooperlings and I have kidnapped the prince. It's okay. Alright, it's ready, Tech. Can you send it? Oh. The message has been sent. For the time being, you may return to your room. I will call you in again when I want to ask you something. Princess Peach, I want to ask you something. Oh. <laughs> uh, okay then. Good night. This is fucking weird. Good night, Princess Peach. I don't know. He's going into rest mode. Or I guess sleep mode. Stuff. Bowser is in this game. Yeah. 
Oh, I love those guys! The armor Koopas? Looks so cool. Oh shit, the man himself! You wanna go voice Bowser? <laughs> How does Jack Black sound? <laughs> sound like Jack Black. Bowser, the mighty Koopa King has arrived! Hold your applause, minions! Peaches, 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 peaches. <laughs> but now that I'm here, Cammy, you crusty old hag, why did you summon me? Oh, uh, Great Lord Bowser, the uh, crusty hag, Cammy Koopa, will arrive momentarily. I'm really sorry for the inconvenience, but please wait at the, the rear of the room. Hold on, can I like. Uh -uh. I could talk to everyone. Hey, your gashiness, I have to ask you to wait in your rear of the room. Greetings, your stuffiness, the hag Tommy Koopa will, will be arriving at any moment. Hey, what do you guys fucking have to say? So the other day, I saw Lord Bowser glazing longingly at a photo of Princess Peach. Uh, you may want to put a cork in it, man. Oh, I tell you, that look on his face when he was mooning over that thing? Huh? Bowser. Well, I'm dying to hear the rest of your hilarious story, Mr. Comedian. Do share! Peaches, 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 peaches. Lord Bowser, I have been training day and night to help you conquer the world. Should the time come, I shall be ready. Order me as you please, your scrolliness. Uh, super. In that case, I order you to do some sit-ups, tubby. And Bowser, Bowser, you need to do Fucking setups. What do you guys say? Yeah, Lord Bowser! Lord Bowser, please, if it's not too much, head to the rear of the hall. Oh, right here. Oh, I was gonna talk to these guys. Yes. Shit. Ah! Lord Bowser! I'm just gonna play all the old people in this. You fucking old hag! Ah, holy shit, you guys are gonna make this hallway a lot more like, short. <coughs> I've just now returned! I'm terribly sorry to keep you waiting, my lord! You guys gotta make this hallway shorter! I, uh, my cardiac arrest is triggered! <laughs> I bet you are, Kemi Koopa. Now out with it, why have you called me here? Please, your grumpiness! Don't be so impatient with your poor servant! <clears throat> Ahem! It is my displeasure to report that Mario, that scum, is off at a town called Rogueport. <laughs> <laughs> Am I Mario's babysitter? I don't give a shit what he's doing. <laughs> Are you going to call me every time that guy blows his nose or what? Sheesh. Next thing you're going to say is that he got Princess Peach's nudes. Well, yes, you see, my lord, apparently Mario is hunting for an amazing treasure. And we went through his mail, we found Princess Peach's nudes, that's crazy! <laughs> what? Nudes? <laughs> yes! Uh, well, uh, the treasure part was more important, but anyway... <laughs> yes, Lord Mario has gone in search of a star-shaped jewel known as the Crystal Stars. I'm researching just what they are, but no question of their high value! The Crystal Stars, you say? They sound like good world-conquering tools, I want them! Hmm, yes, very good. Continue researching this for me, you brainy hag, you. Yes, sir. Thank you, sir. Leave it to me. By the way, Lord Bowser, do you like fried eggs? Well, do you like fried eggs? I do like fried eggs. Uh, you bet I do, alright? Fried eggs are fucking awesome. Uh, do, do I? I love fried eggs. I love them, but what a weird question. Why do you ask? Well, during my Mario Recon, I stopped by a lovely place called Petto Meadows. I was planning on taking everyone there on a picnic, having some eggs and toast. Of course, I wouldn't think of sending out invites without asking you first, Lord Bowser. Airhead! A picnic, you moron! This is no time for fun. My sandwiches! <laughs> See, this is why my evil plans always derail, because you clods always goof off. Ah! Oh dear, Lord Bowser, please calm down! Remember your blood pressure! What's that? What the fuck are you wanting? What? Is that true? Lord, can you stop fucking stopping? 
Lord Bowser, terrible news! Some bold fool abducted Princess Peach in Oakport! Uh, what? My peaches? <laughs> Tell me you're lying, Cammy. How? When? Where? Wh who'd do such a thing besides me? I'm afraid we don't know that much information quite yet. The investigation's ongoing. One important thing is certainly confirmed, however, the princess has been kidnapped. And it wasn't you this time! <laughs> Under no circumstances is anyone allowed to kidnap her without my say-so. I will not stand for this. I need to sit down. I'm going to Rogueport now. I've got to kidnap her back. Sure! Oh, she fucking kicked the old lady. <laughs> oh, look at this car! Poor Bowser, that's gonna leave a lot of mess. <laughs> Our budget's all gone now! Why ain't your grunginess swing up? The building department's gonna have a field day with this one! <laughs> you could've just gone out the front door! Yes! Save all game progress up to this point? Sure! <laughs> To a bunch of Bowser heads. Is he gonna blink? Here's Mario, just blinks. Oh, if they're a happy family now. Oops, my lad. Are you telling me that you're going with Mario? Hi, um, that's right, father. I'm going to continue traveling with Mario. And then I'm, well, I'm going to come back a strong Koopa like you, Dad. Nicely said, young Koops. That's my boy. Well, anyways, remember this. You're always my son, Koops. And I'm your father. You're okay, father. <laughs> Coops, my sweet, I'll be right here waiting for you to, to prove yourself. Ugh, why I just add, if anything happens, you can always come here, Coops. Don't you ever forget that. This village is always be your home. Why are all my characters that I voice in one line? <laughs> okay, thank you, everyone. Well, I'm off. Wow, you went really far, Coops. <laughs> Sorry to keep you waiting, Mario. You know farewells. So, uh, you're, uh, where are we going? Oh, fucking no. I guess back to Rogueport. Let's head back to Rogueport! Well, Bella, I just said that. You my lines. Remember, Mario? The bearer of the magical map shall unfurl it before they get the thousand year door. When this is done, the stars shall guide the bearer to the crystal star with pure light. Man, you gotta release this shit on SoundCloud, my girl. And it didn't stop there. Oh. Each crystal star shall point to the next. That's what the books say. Which means, if we take the crystal star we found back to the thousand year door... So, I, uh, uh, that means the location of the next crystal star will appear on the magic map. Exactly! Come on, let's go! Alright, Dan, you guys are fucking pushy around here. Can you, can you tell them about this guy real quick? That's Koop's dad, Koopley! He seems kinda out of it. Are all Koopas space cats? <laughs> then again, Koops is really with it. Maybe that's cause his dad is like this. Anyway, Koopley does worry about Koops a lot, so I guess he's a good dad after all. Aw, that's cute. What about the mayor? That's Croop, the mayor of Petalburg. He just babbles whether he's alone or not. I just can't tell if he's really senile or if he's just working that angle, you know? Same. Well, we did it! We completed chat. Get the fuck out of here. We completed- Oh wait, 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 there's a bad right here. Come on. How do you do this again? Mega punch. Mega rush P. Increase attack power by 5 when the par when your partner's in peril. <laughs> just gonna- Just keep walking. We got the shit. We completed chapter 1! Is that exciting? That is exciting. Yeah! A little one step closer to finishing the game. And we, and we brought peace to land. Hell yeah. Yeah. Oh yeah, that bomb is still there. Double progress? Absolutely. Now this ran a little longer, so I'm sorry if I didn't say goodbye in the last one, but uh, I'm gonna probably split this into two parts. <laughs> Yeah. I didn't realize how long it would go on, but anyway. But this this was a lot of fun. I'm loving this game so far. I see why people praise Sounds in Your Door so much compared to all the other Paper Mario games. So I, I see the hype. And I'm here for it. 
I'm, I'm glad I get to experience this on a, an a actual GameCube with an actual copy of the game. Yep. 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 Uh, anyway. <laughs> Well, I guess that's gonna do it. I guess next episode we'll head to Roadport, we'll uh, shine our magical map at the door and find the next location of the next Crystal Star, and I guess maybe see if there's anything else in town now that with our new ability. Why not? Yep. No more in the underground. I love exploring. Me too. Alrighty, well my name is Phoenix and that was Cameron. I guess we'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye!